Hey guys, Mike here. So we're here to do a couple things today. We've got a concrete driveway we're going to seal. You can see that in the background. All right, we got about an 1,800 square foot concrete driveway we're going to seal. And we're going to use Radon Seal's last to seal concrete sealer. Okay, last to seal from Radon Seal. This is a penetrating sealer. It's not going to leave a film on the surface. It's going to penetrate down deep into the concrete, plug all the pores, and seal it up really good. Um, we're using Tomahawk's concrete sprayer so tomahawk saw me spraying and sealing some concrete with my with my chapin stainless steel sprayer and they wanted to send me their gas powered sprayer because they saw about every 60 seconds i gotta stop and pump up this pump up sprayer so their gas powered sprayer you don't have to do that it's constant pressure to the sprayer so they want me to try this out for you guys and, and see how it's going to work and let you know so that's what we're here to do today. We've got 1,800 square feet. We're going to seal. i got about 10 gallons of seal we're going to put down. It's just one coat we're putting down today. So we're going to try this out. All I had to do, it came pretty much ready to go. All I had to do is I had to, I had to screw the hose on. That was real easy. I had to screw the wand on. That was real easy. And then I had to, I had to, put, the, I had to put the straps on. So they clip on right here. And then I had to just hook them around here. So that was really so it's real easy to get set up and then i put my gas in it started it up it started right up so i'm gonna put two and a half gallons in it it'll hold about six gallons but that thing's gonna be pretty heavy for me at six gallons i think so i'm just gonna put two and a half in at a time and spray that out and i just wanted to show you guys you know the consistent pressure that i'm not gonna have to stop until i'm done with sealer and i gotta refill it again but let's try it out and see how it works all I did to prep was I just used my my uh, leaf blower, my backpack leaf blower to clean it. We want dry concrete. We're going to be putting just one coat on. If your concrete's really, really porous, then you come back a day later and you can spray on another coat. This concrete's not too bad, so one coat's going to do it. You can see it's got a filter in there, so that's really good. That way, if you have any little tiny particles, you can see I got a couple little particles in there already. It's not going to clog up your tip, so the filter thing is really, really good. And let's get it on the truck and get it on my back. Try it out. Choke it, you can prime it right here.
So there's the first two and a half gallons. I can tell you already it sprays on real nice and even, consistent. It's a lot faster than the chapin. I got 10 gallons to do this. I'm gonna get this off my back. We'll put some more in it. With two and a half gallons in this thing, it wasn't too heavy, so I'm gonna try five gallons in it this time, and we'll spray on some more. All right, we got five gallons of sealer in it this time. We're gonna check it out, see how heavy that is. Um, it felt quite a bit heavier just lifting it up, but we'll see how it feels on the back. All right guys, so Tomahawks gas powered backpack sprayer. My first initial reaction is I, I really like it. For spraying water-based sealers or any water-based type products, it definitely has even pressure, which saves a lot of time and puts the product on a little bit more evenly than if you're using a regular pump-up sprayer. So I would definitely highly recommend getting one of these if you spray a lot of water-based products. Um, I just sprayed 1,800 square feet of driveway and about 300 square feet of walkway in about four or five minutes. So with my pump up sprayer, that would have took five times longer than that. It would have took me 20, 25 minutes. Now because it has a gas powered motor, you can't spray solvent based sealers through it, just water based. So just keep that in mind. Solvent based sealers, you're gonna to wanna to stick to the pump up sprayers. But any of these water-based ones, like this Last the Seal, Last the Seal's concrete sealer from Radon Seal is great. Now this driveway is about 16 years old. It's still in really great shape, but it just needed to be sealed. 
So last to seal is a great sealer for that. Great on seal makes that. If you've got any questions about last to seal, you can contact their customer support. As for Craig, Craig knows everything about sealing. That's his specialty. But for a 16 year old driveway, this is going to soak down into the concrete. It's going to block the pores. It's going to make water run off a lot easier. We get a lot of freeze and thaw here in Maine, so it's going to help protect it against salt damage. And it's just going to prolong the life of the concrete a lot longer. So this concrete driveway should last easily another 15, 20 years. And again, Tomahawk Concrete Sprayer. Um, I highly recommend it. Go out, try it. I have a link for it down in the description, guys, so check it out.